Hey everyone, what about here and welcome to Keeper RL as part of, I guess, the indie game lightning round, but mainly as part of my, my charity drive for UNICEF to support uh, Ukrainian children that are being impacted by the Russian invasion, uh, which normally I wouldn't bring up in one of these videos too much just because, you know, not going to be relevant in a week or so. However, one of the key details is Keeper RL's developer is currently running a promotion that if you donate to one of the charities uh, that he lists, I'm doing UNICEF, which I believe is not actually one of the listed ones. Uh, but if you check the Steam page for Keeper RL, there's a uh, the most recent post has a list of reputable charities, and you can email confirming your donation to the developer of Keeper RL, and it'll send you a free copy of it. So if you guys do want to donate to a good cause and get Keeper RL in the process, uh, go check that out. But speaking of checking out, I've never played this game before, so I should probably do the tutorial. Okay. Hi. I have not played this game before, so this is going to be kind of weird. How do I explore the map? Okay, Mandoff. Oh, okay, I can click to move and tell him to go places. Well, while we do that, structure, digger cut tree. Now, I haven't played this too much before. I did part of the tutorial before I started losing it, so... I'm not going to try too overwhelmingly hard here. Let's do something like that. With like a 3x4 room. There we go. Uh, next sort of thing we want to do... Storage. Storage, resources. And do like a 4x4. Okay. I don't play a whole lot of Dwarf Fortress likes. I used to play a ton of Dwarf Fortress when I was in college and it was a ton of fun. But I I think I just got bored after a while. That was back when... Oh, gosh. What were the... Was it Trout? It was Trout. That was back when Trout were an actual, like, deadly force to be reckoned with. Let's see. Okay, let's pause for a second. Wait, what is this? Imp... Oh, I see. So to get these guys, I need a forge, workshop, or a jeweler, and some beds. Well, what can I do? So I can do floors, storage, zones, a bookcase, some living stuff, farming, training room, workshop, installations. Okay. I'm kind of generally of the opinion of I like to have my, my people live maybe further in. Carp. That's what it was. Yeah, the carp age. I... I remember when that was, like, that was the prime... One of the primary threats that you actually really had to get consider. This is not the best mountain to be in. To be honest. I'm just gonna extend this. Probably should have explored around a little bit. But we might just have, like, a, a very... Squiggly area for quite some time, because this is the outside again. I wish I could explore better. But maybe we'll figure it out. Okay. So, structure, dig or cut. Oh, right. I'm just gonna make kind of a big room here for the time being. I don't really have much else that I can do. It looks like I'm surrounded by a decent chunk of water. Which is good or bad. Could just be a mountain around an inner open area. Yeah. I mean, who knows? We could have, like, an interior lake. Okay. But living... We need some basic beds. I should have enough. Okay, zones, quarters. Okay. Oh, these are dudes that will come in. So we need a forge or workshop or jeweler for both of the artificers to show up. Okay. Crafting. So we need just a basic workshop. Maybe we need two. So these are just random monsters that will come in and help. Okay. 
Okay, so that's how we get more. So we're also going to need gold, but I don't know how to get gold. And we need a wooden training dummy. So for now, I'm just going to probably spread these things around. Just so I can get some more minions. Okay. Get torches to light things up. Coffins, dining tables, library zones, racks, floors. Installation, torches. It looks like I can grab him. Smelly breath, but an enter turner. Needs another forge workshop. Okay. Might as well grab a couple of these guys. We are going to have to worry about food, though. Farming. But we got to get tech for that. Okay. So what we probably need... No, train your minions' magical powers here. How do we get science? Okay. No, laboratory produces potions, but that's not it. Uh, man, I'll research items available. But it looks like it can't research anything until we conquer some villains. How do we do that? Oh, okay, here we go. So does no backseating imply rhetorical questions here? Sometimes yes, though in this case, uh... Use the travel command while controlling a minion or team. A minion team. I got it. Okay. How do I see how many... Where my goons are? New team. Drag and drop to a new new team button. Are artificers even good fighters? Not really, no. But I kind of want to... Oops. Disband that team. I might want to just send these guys off. Okay, new team. Where's the travel button? Okay, travel command while controlling a minion... Okay, so I have to control them. So do we go after the tree spirits? Sure. Let's see what happens. Okay. This is probably a terrible idea, but we'll find out very quickly. Display message message history. Okay, so that didn't work. Apparently an elven archer said no. So how the heck do I get more EXP then? Where's a wooden bookcase or a laboratory? Well, we can get the bookcase. I I think we're probably going to want to switch over to... Here, let's pause for a second, get a new artificer. I think we want a bunch of rooms that are just three t tiles wide. At least until we get bigger things. Bandit... Is killed by a goblin warrior. Pig is killed by a goblin warrior. Oh. Oh, that's a good way of getting some food. Now that I'm thinking about it. Maybe. How do I... How do I tell my dudes to get food? Orders. Claim tile. Fetch items. Fetch? Fetch. 
I might I might want to take my goblins out. Okay, he's wounded. Wait, where are the rest of my goblins? Okay. So he's pretty wounded. Which is an issue. Okay. Exit control mode. There. Hopefully they'll come back and hopefully he'll heal. Okay, Mandalf has leveled has reached melee training level. Okay, so that's actually something to consider. We need a bookcase. Looks like we can get a couple, actually. So I'll just kind of fill those out. Do you want advice? Yeah, sure. I, I could use some advice here. I am... I'm fumbling a little bit, namely just because... I only partly understand, uh... the fundamentals here. My main fear is food. I know the tutorial might have covered food, but, uh... Let's see. Use your artificer to make weapons and armor. Okay. How do I tell them to make anything? Show tasks. No, skills furnished, assigned acti assigned quarters, activity idle. I've told it to kind of do those things. Because there's crafting. Oh! Here we go. That would explain things. Let's get three clubs. Okay. And then, like, maybe some more boots? Okay. I think those will just have to do. What is, the, what is this? Ah. Is this just my overall build order? Looks like it is. Okay. We'll just leave that for the time being. Don't send your artificers into battle. Yeah, it's fair. Okay, so how do I tell these guys to go hunting or get some food? Because I know that's going to be a problem. Oh, right. That was the other thing I was going to do. I was going to build... Uh, let's see. Structures. Orders. Insulation. Torch. Okay, and it has to be on a wall. There we go. Okay, let's just set that up. Do we grab some more wizards? More basic beds, more bookcases. Oh, this makes sense. So if I do that... we get two more bookcases. We're just going to end up with, like, tons of... We're just going to end up with tons of wizards, aren't we? So you actually, uh, you, they don't need food, but eating them makes them happy. Got it. Oh, we also need a wooden training dummy. Kill some enemies or summon a succubus. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, that's a goblin warrior. Okay. A lot of this makes sense. Grab him. So I don't know how to summon a succubus, nor is that something I necessarily want to mess around with. I've got a decent raiding party, maybe. Oh, let's see, almost next to no resources. Torches, message board. We'll put a message board there. 
I don't know what that does. Okay, what else do we have? Increases luxury. Oh, leave messages for other players. Painting thing, candelabrum, barricades, eyeballs. Portal. Connection to another portal if anything is present. And then demon shrine, but it requires demon tech. Okay, cool. So let's go back to this and move our goblin warriors and wizards into this. Question. Nope. How do I equip these guys? Oh, I see. It looks like they might auto-equip some of these things. Well, in that case, let's just make a bunch of leather armors, helms, boots, and gloves. Maybe like two more clubs. Okay. So the message board is for the PvP segment. If you get raided. Got it. How do I destroy something? that I've built. Is it just digger cut tree? No. Oh, buildings in Zila. Oh, they're Z levels, of course. Okay, orders. Ah, remove construction. Yeah, let's just get rid of that. Next up, installation, no? I saw stairs earlier. Oh, it's probably... No, it isn't an installation. How have I missed where the stairs went? Oh, I can get a goblin priest. Oh, here it is. Downstairs. No, stairs don't cost me anything. Okay, Z level 1. Digger cut. And we can dig out all of this iron ore. Oh, we're moving up in the world. I understand now. And this is a bunch of granite. Okay. Okay. Go back to this. We've got a number of dudes that I can get. However, the population limit has been reached, so I can't do anything with that until we get some more food. Which means I gotta figure out how to do research, and I'm pretty sure to do research means I have to conquer some villains to advance my level. Okay, so if I go back to that. I have a decent war party. It's the priest. Put it in that mix. Let's grab a bunch of shields, too. And if I go back to this, there was a storage, armor rack. Oh, here we go. And a weapon rack. Bow rack, potion rack, everything else, eh. Okay, go back down. How's this looking? Decent. I'm going to just turn this into a storage area so they can actually collect all the iron. At least in this section. Okay. Well. We're kind of in a spot. We have a bunch of goblins, but I can't do anything about it. At least for the moment. They're unhappy. Club plus four. So we definitely need more armor. Yeah, I do only have two goblin warriors. Okay. This is crafting queue going. I guess I'm just going to build a bunch until they actually put it on. Oh, you know what? It's probably the artificers that are also grabbing it too. Test run on the village? Absolutely. 
I'll have to figure out how to how to attack because I have I have no idea. I've never controlled this group before. Okay, here's the other question. I want to take a look at this guy. So, attributes, training, combat experience. Creature's limit for this type of training is 7. Okay, so hopefully we get some better dudes later. Oh. Like this aura behind M Merzonk, the goblin priest, might mean he's stronger than the rest? Or maybe that just means he's a priest. Not fully clear. Oh, that's okay. Hey, thank you, Matthias 720, for the what is that? 20 months resub. 20 months already. Feels like just last month I was subbing for the first time during the COVID lockdown. Oof. But thank you. Okay. Do we wanna take them out? Oh, I can also increase the speed. Okay, that should be good enough. Are both of my warriors fully equipped? No. It looks like I need boots, a helmet, and maybe some shields. I'm probably going to need some more wood, so I should go chop some more down. There we go. Alright. Your dungeon keeper is very powerful as well, and can gain EXP, but if he dies, you lose. I think I might want to wait a little bit. Ooh, goblin shaman. But we're at our population limit, so there's nothing I can do about it. At least for the moment. You need weapons for your minions. Who is underweaponed? Because it doesn't look like the artificers fight. Okay, he's got boots now. Club. Uh, actually, it looks like we could use some more clubs. Interesting. Okay. Well, one way or another, I think we've got our, our battle party. Okay, shall we control them? Because one of the wizards is missing a spell. Yeah, conquer an enemy tribe to increase your malevolence level. How are the rest of them doing? I mean, it seems like it's just... N nothing's gonna happen. The morale is bad. Yeah, okay. Let's... Let's go on a bender. Let's see, switch leader. Alright, cool. Time to fight. We're gonna go take out that village. I don't really know how combat works in this game, unfortunately. Oh boy! My goblin wizards are... Uh, way more effective than I thought. All I have to do is herd the farmers in. Okay. Goblin wizard is wounded. Okay. We have bandits here. Oh, my poor priest. There we go. Thank you, priest. 
There we go. What do we have in this this little location? Tribe of Bandits is destroyed. And a random vulture came at us. All right. Get back here. Creature. Oh, it was probably attracted by the corpses and then became violent. Unfortunately, none of my wizards learned how to bridge. Okay, looks like I can destroy doors. Uh, click or press enter. To loot. Sleep in basic bed. Tribe of humans is destroyed. Oh, there was another one. Bash the dining table. Hmm. That was, that's a little dark. Right, let's see if there's any anyone else in my lands that I need to... Uh... <sighs> that I need to do away with. Looks like I might actually have to rely on... I'm going to have to rely on my uh, my imps to actually mine there. Well, here's the question. Do I want to try and build a bridge? Can I build a bridge? Maybe? Let's just do that, because... Oh, yeah, wooden bridge. Here we go. Okay, one way or another, I'm going to let these guys sleep it off. Get all their HP back, at least for the time being. So, ah, we can do a thing. So we can do archery, distillation, jewelry, or chicken breeding. I'm going to go for chicken breeding, namely because... Okay, farming, chicken coop. Oh, I have to put it inside? What? All right, structure... Just do that. Okay. Looks like I missed a number of things. I'm not sure how to go find them. Well, it's fine. I'll just close those. Okay. Also, recommend installing some flooring. Do I have stone? I do. Okay. Let's be aesthetically pleasing here. I'll just do this for the time being. Okay, I should probably also get a door down. Oh, uh, it's... No, 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 we don't have forges yet. Or do we? Looks like it can actually... Put an iron door in. Perfect. Then I'm going to have a second section there. Not the best setup for me to do some farming here, unfortunately. I'll see what I can do. If this is some more space, I'll probably put the chickens up here. This game is one of those where it's super easy for me to just boop, uh, boot up and play all day. It's super chill. I don't know why I've been putting off playing this for so long. I guess I'm kind of glad I did because now I've got uh, an easy excuse for uh, for playing it today. Uh, da, 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 da. Installations. Go with that. Get some torches just all over the place. Okay, there we go. I don't know how much my my dudes care. Okay, pause for a second. We want to do farming. Chicken coop. 
Now, is chicken coop is a thing that I put in? Or... I guess I'll find out. Farming, animal fence. Like, is it effectively a, a floor thing? Or is it a structure? Okay, looks like it's a floor thing. Okay, so what is my pop cap at? 10 out of 14, so it's probably based on how much food I currently have available. Am I out of wood? Why can I not build more farm here? Or is this room just at max capacity? Uh? We need dirt, perhaps? No, it uses wood. Huh. Weird. Move construction on that. I guess, I guess I'm just going to do a second set of animal fences here. And remove those. Okay. So now we have that. I have no idea how to feed them to my dudes. But that's okay. All those chickens are just trapped now. So I can get some more. Oh. Gorgu the Harpy requires a training dummy and a ranged weapon. Well, I don't have any of that. I wouldn't mind a shaman, though. Bookcase or a laboratory. Let's grab the shaman. Doesn't look like it's special. And yeah, unfortunately, I can't get an iron dummy because we need iron working. But at least we can get an another dude to go into the war party. Uh, Goblin Shaman goes to that. Okay. Let's go back here. Because there's something there. A swimmer is pointless on harpies. I was more just thinking of getting harpy. What the hell? Statue of Evil God Adoxy. I... Sure. Wooden Bridge. Let's go check this out. I'm just going to control Mandalf. I'm going to go visit the evil god. I don't want to bash it. Huh. I don't know what to do about well I guess I'm just gonna leave it there for now uh, let's see I guess honestly we might as well just start kind of expanding here see if we find anything else interesting on this map I should probably go elsewhere too Yeah, do we want to get some more wizards? Sure. Uh, no, I should probably get some more warriors. Okay, wooden dummy. Okay, st structure, digger cut. Let's not do that. Let's, let's just do a series of, like... Three by three rooms. Realize that's going to open up a little bit to the water, but I don't think that's much of a problem. My logic is I can use this area as a series of just kind of spare housing locations for my dudes. At least until I can figure something else out. And what to do with them. I don't know. How do I feed chicken to my dudes? I can banish a chicken. Uh, that's fair. Are my guys satiated? 
the morale is bad. Nope. I don't actually know how to feed chickens to dudes. Unless I can... Wait. Oh. Oh, did the shaman just summon a bunch of stuff? Dinner table. Thank you. Uh, it's probably under living? Dining table. Oh. Orders. Remove construction. Okay. Living. Dining table. One, two... I'll just put them there. Question. Can I do floors? The lava or water. Requires a decent chunk of stone, but I'll do it there at the very least. I'll have to fill it in the rest of the way. Here's a question. Does... Does a stone wall... Increase prestige? It doesn't look like it. Well, hopefully my dudes will start eating. Oh! Damage when drunk. Damage when riding a steed. Damage when riding a steed. An extra melee training potential and he just winked out of existence. Shoot. Uh, let's go for the dude that hates humans. Oh, I should probably also move my gold pile inside. But where though? Oh. Storage. Resources. Okay, can I... There's no way that I can actually control this. I have no idea if people are going to raid my things. So smoothed and constructed walls increase beauty purely for morale. I mean, morale is good. Oh, but I have to dig everything else first. Well, that's unfortunate. Whoa! Thank you, Mini Mergle, for the $100 donation to UNICEF. Thank you so much. That's big. Let's see. Build a treasure chest. Ah, got it. Where are those? I'll just keep looking around. I'll figure it out. There's also a prison, which is interesting. Uh, let's see. Golden statue. Increases population limit. And that's an option. Hates all elves. I mean, Bumbug the Goblin Wizard seems like he is better. Okay, I'll just do two beds here. As one of the guys pushing you to do this stream, gotta put my money where my mouth is. Yeah. I was meaning to do uh do something. I, I spent a substantial portion of Thursday just researching um charities just to figure out like, you know, which ones uh which ones are good or not. Let's grab Bumbug. Hates. Okay, chest should be under the storage tab. Oh, yeah. Treasure chest. There we go. I'm going to put it underground. Uh, let's see. Structure, storage. What else? Yeah, we've gotten the rest of this. You know what I should probably do, though? Pause. Installation torch. There we go. Extend that. Perfect. Okay. Still don't know what I'm going to be doing above. Because I have minimal tech. Okay. Uh, I guess next order of business. Let's figure out what's in this question mark. I'm not going to do anything with that. Oh yeah, there's a potion over there. Let's see. There we go. So, oh my goblin wizards are learning, like, better spells too. Okay, that's neat. Hopefully at some point we unlock some more. Oh, can see, can see in the dark. If I want to grab... 
Murga the Goblin Warrior. We are grabbing that sucker. He is insane. Plus 13 damage. I'll take it. Okay, keep going and then I want to see what's here. Sane ones are dangerous, Wander. Eh. Wait. Goblin Warrior is killed by a winged Goblin Warrior. What? Okay. Insane ones will kill your friends. Good to know. That would explain it. Oh. I think he died. I, I think he just got killed. I'm hoping. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not seeing any other fe features, so I'm gonna just assume. Uh, let's see. Do we go for another shaman? What is the aura behind? Or does it just mean it has a feature? Well, one way or another, I think another shaman would be a good idea. Because they seem to summon things, and that seems kind of fun. Yeah, aura just means trait. Got it. Hey, you know what? Let's grab the warrior. Okay, looked like there was something there. I'm just going to set some torches at regular intervals. Give me something to do for a moment. This area is dark, dark as heck anyway. You know what, let's give the evil god some light. As well, just because. Okay, so what's my population? 14 out of 14. Uh, it's, how does... Okay, increase population up to 4. That's why I couldn't build more. We were kind of capped on, uh, we are capped on chickens. What am I doing on wood? I'll need to cut some more trees. Is there a way that I can grow trees? I don't know. For now, I guess we're just gonna loot every tree in the immediate area. Let them do their thing. Sup, Adoxy? I could also just destroy the head, like a... Well... Would it be monstrous to destroy an evil god shrine? Eh. High population makes you a bigger target. Eh. Okay. So we found something here. But it disappeared. I'm just gonna build a bridge. We'll just see what's in there. Let's see. Oh, and I can buy an imp. Which does not count against my pop cap. Perfect. Okay, what else do I do? Oh, it did say killed by Kraken Tentacle at the top. Oh. It's probably one of my imps. Okay, you know what? Orders... Orders. Forbid zone. Orders. Remove constructions. Uh, structure. Stone wall. There's a Kraken in there. Yep, we'll just leave that for for later. Probably not today. Okay. So in that case, now what do we do? I've got a ton of wood. Got some things. There's some critters around, but nothing to care too much about. And there's that. And there's the Kraken. And it seems like this map is actually just... 
got nothing on it. So I could hang out and and chill. I guess I might as well grab some more gloves, shields, boots, helms, armor, and clubs. Because at some point I'm going to have to worry about I'm going to have to worry about enemies. Or enemies? Uh, running out of stuff. How much does this hold? I'm not sure. Well, I might as well just have a, a reasonable amount of resources for a moment. We haven't gotten attacked yet, which is good. I don't know how much we need to care. Destroy your dungeon, rebuild it across the cracking, uh, cracking cave for invincibility. Uh, that would be interesting. But I don't think it actually would be that practical. Okay. Are we done making? We're done making things. So I think it's time that we... Make sure everybody's in the party. I thought I got another shaman. Whoa. Okay. Uh, goblin priest. Negative impact on morale. Ugh. Because here's the thing. We have a pair of... A wizard and a priest that are legendary craftsmen. You know what? Uh, let's see. Yeah, the morale hit isn't that bad. That's what I was kind of thinking. Okay. Oh, I need a bookcase. Shoot. Okay, because, yeah, getting a couple of legendary crafters this early seems like it's worth it. 